What is going on guys? Let's make some tissue culture media in the microwave. I'll be using premix tissue culture media. If you want to see how to make media from scratch, check my other videos. This is multiplication media for aquatic plants. Half a strange MSOs, 30 grams of sucrose, 1 mg per liter of BA, and 0.1 mg per liter of NAA. For aquatic plants, I calibrate the pH to 5.6. And using the sodium hydroxide stock solution I made in the last video to increase the pH. I was quite surprised that I got it to 5.6 on the first attempt. I even rinsed the pH meter to make sure everything was correct. For the gelling agent, I'm using gel and gum from Brown Cell Technology, but this method also works for agar or gelson. The recommended amount of gel and gum is 2 to 4 grams per liter of media. I like to stay in the middle and use 3 grams. These are 4 ounce polypropylene cups, but you can also sterilize glass flasks in the microwave. Just make sure they don't have metal lids. I can fit 17 cups in my microwave, so I will have to use it 3 times to sterilize 1 liter of media or 50 cups. Make sure the lids are loose or they will melt. I run the microwave at 50% power for 5 minutes, but that depends on the microwave's wattage, the cup size and its dimensions. Bigger containers like 8 to 32 ounces daily containers can take about 8 to 10 minutes. In total, it took me 25 minutes to sterilize all 50 cups. My All-American 39 liters or 41 quarts pressure cooker can fit 80 cups, but it takes about 2 hours per cycle. You save more time if you are using bigger containers. My pressure cooker would take 2 hours to sterilize 14 32 ounce daily containers. My microwave can fit 9 of those and sterilize them in 10 minutes. Do I recommend using the microwave instead of a pressure cooker? Well, that depends. I think the pressure cooker is more reliable. As long as the pressure cooker can get to 15 psi for at least 20 minutes, you know that the media will be sterile. I know the time and power setting for my microwave, but that does not mean that will work for your microwave. It may take more or less time and use a different power setting. It does work, but you may need to use some try and error. Here is the media after it cooled down and solidified. Same results as the media sterilized in the pressure cooker. For more information, visit plantcelltechnology.com.